poem English title forget everything I said wrote today 14th November 2018 forget everything I said he said I have the truth he said it a few times more it morphed into I alone have the truth then he said it again a few more times it became I own the truth I own the truth many heard him most laughed but he kept saying it then one day another said I believe you. Now, both own the truth. Some more agreed, we believe you. Many still laughed at them. But they kept saying, we own the truth. Upon hearing them time and again, many more joined. Many more said, we own the truth. Now, only a few laughed at them. One of them laughed a bit too loudly. They killed her. No one laughed. Those who owned the truth said, all is fair in the service of the truth. Some of the others became angry. The two sides fought. They fought again and again and again and again. Who won? The ones who thought they owned the truth. Not because they actually owned the truth. No one knows who owned the truth. Or if the truth was ownable. Or even if the truth was knowable. Yet the believers believed it. And the disbelievers disbelieved it. The believers won. And the disbelievers turned believers. The disbelievers turned believers. They loved their skin far too much. The believers ruled. The belief ruled. Why? Because fiction has greater power over human minds than the absence of that fiction. Because fiction has greater power over human minds than the absence of that fiction. Fiction gives confidence to the believer. Confidence kills. Nazis kill Jews and many more. Jews kill Islamists and many more. Islamists kill Kafirs which includes everyone other than the killers brand of Islamists. Cow savers kill Muslims confident that they are all Islamists. Cow savers kill Muslims, confident that they are all Islamists, Muslims, and most non-cow believers kill cows. Muslims and most non-cow believers kill cows. All or almost all kill chicken. All, actually all 
kill habitats which kills non-humans and then humans homo sapiens kill homo sapiens in wars genocides massacres in wars genocides massacres slavery manufactured famines other hate slavery manufactured famines other hate politics mismanagement religion not to mention not to mention women who drink from their water not to mention women who drink from their water homo sapiens kill dodos mastodons homo neanderthalensis homo erectus homo floresiensis homo sexuals confidence kills fiction gives confidence to the believer because fiction has greater power over human minds than the absence of that fiction the more you believe a fiction the more confident you become the more you believe a fiction the more confident you become the more power it gives you the more power it gives you the more you kill the more you kill the more you kill anyone who disagrees with you the more you kill anyone who disagrees with you why because your mind knows that what you believe most fervently is actually a fiction and does not want you to know what it knows it speaks the language of truth to itself for all natural phenomena speak that for all natural phenomena speak that and only that but it your mind speaks the language of fiction to h sapiens for all h sapiens speak that for all h sapiens speak that for all h sapiens speak only that for all h sapiens speak only that also because your mind does not want to die also because your mind does not want to die and if it talks to you in a non fictive language and if it talks to you in a non fictive language you will lose your confidence and then you will lose your power h sapiens became the undisputed emperors of this earth upon the coat tails of their fictive cognitive power the power to create an owned truth the power to create an owned truth a mass subjective truth a mass subjective truth a mass earnestly believed delusion a mass earnestly believed delusion that power will be lost our empire our power our survival is built upon our ability our mind's ability to speak convincing fiction to delude ourselves into believing any convenient fiction to the extent of finding it our own truth our individual minds our individual minds our collective mind lies to us so that it can help us survive long and then survive our death the truth 
does not rule the human world. The truth does not rule the human world. Lies do. If it were not so, if it were not so, scientists would be emperors. Scientists would be emperors. But no great emperor has ever been a good scientist. No great emperor has ever been a good scientist, but always, but always a storyteller par excellence. A storyteller par excellence. Forget everything I said. <laughs>